The journey to college sports is tough for any aspiring athlete, but especially those from some of our area's smaller schools. Yeah, but some go big time. Less than 3% of high school football players go on to Division I schools. But one player in our viewing area isn't just making that a reality. He's doing it really in an improbable way. Curtis Quillen is here with Brayton Arp's journey from six man to the D1. Hey, Curtis. Hey, guys, it's incredibly rare to see a six man football player played by the smallest schools in Texas go on to play Division One college ball. But Parkview Christian Academy's Brayden Arp is headed to do just that this fall. As a baby, as a kid, I always had a football in my hand. Uh, I mean, up until I was about eight or nine, I'm pretty sure I slept with the football every single night. Like I, and football has been like one of the biggest parts of my life. If you've watched the Parkview Pacers the past two seasons, odds are you've seen Braden Arp catch a few passes, maybe even a touchdown. Uh, he just kept holding out, saying, "No, I really feel like ACU is where I want to be." Like it's been a lifelong dream, and I, as I got older, you know, I kind of grew up with the fact that you know that's a super hard thing to do. Arp transferred to Parkview, entering his junior year, and his first season helped guide the Pacers to a state championship. Now he's making the improv jump from six man football played by the smallest schools in Texas to Division one college ball. You know, I didn't know Division one, but I knew you could go play somewhere. And um, that was the goal from day one since he walked on campus. I told him, hey, we'll we'll get your name out there and we're going to get you to play somewhere. I don't know where it's going to be, but it's going to be somewhere. It's just like a like a family feeling there when he got there. And so it was really amazing to be a part of and got me even more excited about it. Arp will head to Abilene Christian University after leading the nation in six man football with 1901 receiving yards in 2018. He had interest from small schools across the country, but his dream was ACU. And he hopes that this opportunity in front of him is one where he can put six man athletes like himself on the recruiting map for years to come. Grow up in a small school, don't really get the attention and the uh, you know, what you'd get at a bigger school and for something like this to happen, you know, it's awesome for me. I'm like super proud to say it and uh, for that to have happened to me, but just for the hope it can give the young guys for the future. Now, Braden will officially put pen to paper to play for the Wildcats this coming fall on Friday. Guys.